Oh. Huh. I suddenly sense that my pack is in trouble. I'm sorry to leave you, but I must check on my brothers. Okay. Uh... Alright, see you later, Goris. Uh, hello and welcome back to Fallout 2. So I was doing some off-screen grinding. Um, mostly I was just heading towards San, San Francisco and I ran into like 30 different things that all gave me a ton of experience. Um, so I am level 22 now and I'm pretty sure I'm pretty close to level 23. Yeah. And then level 24 is when I get Sniper, which is going to be amazing. Anyway, I came here so I can get the, um, the implant. But Goris had to leave because his people are in trouble. Hopefully nothing's too bad. Um, alrighty, well let's head in here and let's get the uh, the implant. Hopefully it doesn't... Wait, before we do that, before we do that, let's uh, go talk to the weapon merchant, see if he has anything for trade. Because I also ran into a cave full of robbers and they like all had turbo plasma rifles and like a pulse rifle and a whole bunch of other really expensive stuff. Um, I ended up having to, I ended up having to solo it because if I brought my companions in there, they would just slaughter my companions. But if I went in there solo, I was able to do a little thing where I could do line of sight and then group them all up and kill them all like three at a time with one burst of the Bozar. It was incredible. Anyway, um, I was looking for some weapons. Yeah, mostly actually money. You have money. You do have money. You also have a Vindicator. That would be nice. Uh, how much does this go for? Ten thousand. Um. Well, honestly, I'll trade all I got for another Vindicator, I guess. Uh, hold on. Let's... Bye! Let me, uh, do some sorting. How much carry weight do I have? I have 220 of 250. Okay, so I'll charge up my car with the remainder of the batteries that I have. Eh, with these. And then... That'll give me some space to work with to get a little bit more out of my trunk. Because my car trunk is also all filled up. Heck yeah. Uh, I'll take this and these. Everything lightweight, pretty much. Uh, even these, actually. Can I take both of those? No, I can't. Can I take this? Yes. And is there anything else? Can I take these? Yeah. Can I take this? No. What about one of these? No. Okay. Well, that's good for now, I guess. Uh, I'll store my ammo, since I don't need to hold on to it right now. And I'll store these, since I don't need to hold on to them right now. And, um, I guess that's it? I guess the, the ammo, the flame refuel. And then I'll grab these. And these. Can I grab one of these? I can. Interesting. Grab the other one? I can. And this? Ooh, I can grab so much more now. But I can't grab that. Uh, This? No. How many can I grab? Two? No. One? Yes, I can do one. Alright, that's it for now. I will trade these things for money now. Be right back. I'm gonna do more trading, so on and so forth. Uh, see you when I'm done. Okay, I did as much trading as I could this time around. I'm gonna go get the, uh, the implant. And, um, that'll hopefully refresh the dude's stock, and then I can do some more stuff. Then I'm gonna go check up on Goris and see what's up over there. Alrighty. Uh, one. Yeah, I don't want anything to happen to Goris or his tribe. Uh, I just want to get this thing since I came here for it. Alrighty. Get the little operation here. Uh, yes. Uh, like to be stronger? Yes, I have it right here. Read it. Okay. Two weeks suspension. Yes, I agree. Okay. Been completed. Now I'm at 10 strength, I should be. Yep. Nice. 10 strength, 10 luck. 9 Agility and Intelligence, 7 Perception, going pretty good so far. Uh, so I think I got the Intelligence, Charisma, and Strength procedures, and I just need the Perception? Perception? Or Agility? Maybe it's Agility. Agility makes sense. 
Anyway, let's go back to the trader and, well, I guess I'll just preemptively cut out the me trading with that dude because it's just going to be a bunch of boring trading and getting money and stuff and all that nonsense. So I will be right back. Alrighty, finished up trading. I got another Vindicator minigun. I got a bunch of ammo. I got rid of all my stuff. I got a bunch of skill books. I am set to go. Let's go to Vault 13 and check up on Goris. Hopefully he's okay. Um, yeah. On our way there. Is this close enough? Yeah. Okay, let's go to Vault 13. Oh, no! Oh. Goris? Goris! Oh dear. Oh no. The remains of Matt. Hmm. Not even the this guy? I saw the bodies for a moment and then they disappeared. Come on, let's go. Goris! Please, buddy, friend, Goris, please say you're okay. Okay, there's Goris at least. But everyone else. All this. Oh. Jewel. I learned their names for like 10 minutes, and I already grew very attached to them. Karis! Happened. Goris? I bet it was the Enclave. I bet they came in through here because they ran this whole experiment. I bet they came in here to clear out their experiment. Security cameras recorded what has happened. You should go check it. This? Wait, where? Computer PDU? Where are the security cameras? Which one is the security cameras? Is it this? Just playing in the It's very, very busy. I don't... I don't know where the security cameras are. Um... Where the heck are these security cam- Oh, is, is it in here? Which one? Okay, one moment. I'm gonna look up to see which one it is. Be right back. Okay, uh, this one? No, this one? Voice interface terminal? There we go. Accessing security footage. Loading holographic playback. You're the last, Gruthar. The strain of your the stain of your kind will soon be wiped clean. You tell your so-called president that he will burn for this. Whatever. You were never anything more than a talking animal. That may be. But we were created through your experimentation. You you gave us life! And now. I give you death. Gruthar? Take his body. The doctor wanted a specimen. Attack nab, Gruthar! They took his body. Fucking Jewel, Valdis, and Sandy. Jeez. I'm just gonna face through the wall out of my grief. I wish to avenge my brethren. 
All right, let's do it. Gorse hesitates. The honor joint. Well, that just as regular cheery self. Anyway, um, yeah, I wish to avenge your brethren too. Did the one that I saved out of the Enclave base make it at least? Mm. Well, let's go. Let's go avenge your brethren. Nothing less left for us here. Also, what do I do with the Gek that I have? Is, does that actually have any use? But man, those... The Death Claws were so dang nice. They were the nicest people ever in the whole world. And the Enclave came and was like, oh, let's just kill them all. Hecking heck. Uh, the California Republic. Do I need to go back here for anything? Um, well, I think I have some stuff to do in New Reno. So I suppose I'll go finish all that off. Yeah. Well. Guess there's nothing to be done about it now. Uh, commercial row. Ugh. Ah, jeez. Um. Why is he looking junky? Okay, that's the New Reno Arms, so I can go in there. And sell some stuff, at least. Oh, he's close because it's dark. That's right. Um, uh, what else could I do, perhaps? No one would ever steal my car if I left it here. Dum, dum, dum. Ooh. Chests. This one's a rocket man. The rocket man? Hold on, let me save. Over Jimbin. And then we'll look at the foot lockers. What? Was that actual gun gunfire or was that just, like, the background noise? Anyway, out of my grief, I'm just gonna steal from everybody. They can't stop me. Yeah, that's right. It's all mine. Give it to me. Yes, I want this too. And these. Done. Who needs a vendor when I can just take everything from everyone? Super Sledge, M60, M60. Is this just the light? Wait, that's not a light assault weapon, that's like a different thing, isn't it? Um, well. Okay, give me the ammo. And give me this ammo too, and the pistol. And I will also take the ammo. Well, I, that doesn't have any ammo. Never mind. Yeah, oh. I don't know about that. Okay. The ammo all done. Uh, all of these. This. All these. And I think that's about it. Yeah, I don't really need anything else. But I could get the ammo out of these things. Or at least that one. Okay, okay done. Nobody cares, right? Like, nobody nobody actually minds that I did that. Why? Every time I pass that area, there's gunshots. Weird. Anyway... I'm out of here. I'm leaving. I, my friends were all killed, and now I'm stealing your things. Um. Uh, Sarkub. What's about Sarkub? So you, you'll need to remove that armor. Actually, never mind. Uh, never mind. 
<laughs> yeah, like they're not, they're not gonna stop me. Ding 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 ding. Who are you? Oh, what's your poison, pal? What's on tap? Uh, well, you have some jet, but I don't know what I want to trade for it. Um, probably nothing for now. We'll just we'll just keep going. What's the, what's this whole place about? Do you go to the bathroom with that thing on? Oh, very easily. I just do it. Um, and also, fun fact, it recycles it into drinkable water. Uh, so I don't actually have to have drinks very often. Anyway, I'm going to see what's in here. Are you guys going to stop me? Would, would you guys stop me if I went in here? A comedian. Too busy in his routine. Gecko ghouls, right? Ghouls, man, do they stink. So funny, haha. Ha. That's hilarious, man. I couldn't even tell you how funny that was. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna learn everything that I can off of these bookshelves. Which is to say there's nothing on these bookshelves. Anything in these desks? So they put a comedian in a cage, and I'm assuming so that nobody rips them to pieces from his terrible humor. But I was also just kind of allowed in here. Like, I just, this guy has such terrible humor, I'm, I'm tempted to just shoot him to put him out of his misery. Uh, Bishop's men. Everybody asks me that. Ms. Bishop. Uh, Angela Bishop. Who are the bishops? You don't fall through the floor, Clanky. Yeah, I mean... Uh, Bishop's bodyguards. Can I go talk to this Mr. Bishop? What do you want, pal? Make it quick. What's up those stairs? If you don't know, then you don't need to know. Now blow. I'm here to see Mr. Bishop. No, I know Mr. Bishop's schedule and you ain't on it. He's expecting me. Tell me I'm here. Alright, pal. What's your name? I'll check with the boss. I'll Jim I'm Jimbin. Oh, minute. Listen to me. He doesn't know you. Go away. You're wasting our time. Let me see him. You stupid. Look, get out of here before we beat the rest of your brains out of you. Let me pass. You just earned yourself a ticket to the world of hurt. Uh Well, get ready to do some damage. Little did you know, I have a death claw on my side. I'm sorry, what were you expecting to do with that thing? Um. Hello. So is that going to be like all of them? Yeah. Well, I'll reload. Yeah, because I don't actually feel like killing everyone here. But I want to figure out how to talk to this guy, because I feel like I should. Dude, you can't even like hurt me, dude. Uh, yeah, load game, jumping. Okay, so... Uh... How do I get to talk to Mr. Bishop? Um... I guess I shouldn't worry about it right now. Let's see, jungle. What can we do here? Door frame, door, open, Door. Um. Boxer. A ra rabid boxing fan. Ooh. They're boxing fans, but rabid. And a prostitute. A cute little. Per well, I mean. Fair. Well, and then you immediately go back on it. <laughs> okay. Uh, it takes. Yeah. What do you want, big guy? Who are you? 
You ain't heard of me? Stuart? Stuart Little? Hey, that's a movie, dude. Biggest agent in all of Reno? Someone's done you a disservice not telling you about me, pal. Got a name? I'm Jimbin. Looking to box. Can you help me out? Hmm. I'll give you a chance, but I ain't promising anything. I'm doing you, doing you a favor taking some unknown under my wing. My take is half the winnings. No arguments. Uh, cut it down to 25 and we got a deal. No dice. 50-50 or nothing. If you don't like that, walk. Um... Uh, sure, yeah. Alright. You're gonna need a name. You know, a handle. Something that sounds tough. Mean. Like Jimbin the Hurricane. Jimbin the Brawler. You know. Uh... I guess Hurricane. 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 Not bad. Not bad. It fits. Now it's at the ring. Shall we get to it then? You ready? Let's do it. Round one. Ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls. Tonight's match is brought to you by... Rot Gut. When you absolutely have to have something to drink and something, choose Rot Gut. In this corner, the challenger weighing in at 175 pounds, fresh from the wasteland and new to New Reno, Hurricane. And in this corner, weighing in at 181 pounds, you know him, you love him, Jock. So, without further ado, Let's get ready to beat some butt. Okay, well. Oh boy. Are my companions gonna destroy this man? Okay, turn and let him get up to me. Gonna make you ugly. Too late, bud. Um, bam. For one hit point, bam. For one hit point, bam. No. Three. Well, you know. Uh, miss. This is really. Is this really it? For two hit points, heck yeah, man. For one. Okay, this is gonna take a while. I'll be right back. Well, I, uh, crit insta-killed him. Um. Uh. And the winner is... By means of knockout, by ripping a spine out, dude. Hurricane! Sword is smiling like a jackal. Darn fine performance up there, Hurricane. You looking alright? Feeling alright? Let me know when you're ready for your next match. Um. All right, let me rest a little. I'm ready. Okay. Um. I'll, I'll save. Over. This. Yeah. Um. Huh. Like I guess I could just keep doing that. But it's just a little bit RNG until I get like the insta kill crit. Hey, Hurricane. What's up? Ready to get back in the ring? I'm ready to rumble! Alright then, let's get this circus on the road. Follow him. Round one. Ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls. Tonight's match is brought to you by... Gamma Gulp Beer! When your skin's lacking that special glow, choose Gamma Gulp Beer. In this corner, the challenger weighing in at 175 pounds, fresh from the wasteland and new to new Reno, Hurricane. And in this corner, weighing in at 177 pounds, you know him, you love him, Pete McNeely. So without further ado, Let's get ready to beat some butt. Get round one. Um. 
Goris gets really so excited that to see me fight that he just instantly goes in the nude. Anyway, I'll be right back once more. This is really boring. <laughs> Alrighty. Knocked him out. Um. And the winner is... By means of knockout... Hurricane! Just smile like a jackal. Alright, I'm fine performance up there. Hurricane, doing alright, feeling alright. Um, let me rest a little. Inventory. Uh, boxing gloves. Hold on. What do I? Do I keep getting money for this? Uh, well. Uh, hold on. I'll be right back. I'm gonna see what the point of this is. Okay, interesting. So let's go to the Shark Club here. And apparently it has a basement? Hmm. Are there stairs down? Where is this basement? Tell me. Tell me now. Oh, the stairs down are just underneath the stairs up, obviously. Um, hmm. A boxer. Can I get there? Well, save game. Done. Plated boxing gloves. Hmm. A couple of stim packs. Yeah, I'll take these. Done. Let's buff out. Okay, I'll take that too. And then this last one. Jerky. Eh, alright. Done. Nothing else? Okay, I'll go up then. And now that I have the plated boxing gloves... Uh, only 10 pounds. Still only 3 AP. Good. Alrighty. So, they're the ones that look like this, and these are the ones that look like that. If I eat these, this jerky, will that do anything? That does nothing. That does nothing. That does nothing. Alright. Well, let's... Give this another shot, then. Now we have the plated boxing gloves. Maybe this will make it go a little bit faster. Uh, hey, Hurricane, what's up? Ready to get back in the ring? I'm ready to rumble. All right, then. Let's get the circus on the road. Round one. Ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls. Let's get it done. Tonight's match is brought to you by... The cat's paw. When you got that itch that you need to scratch, head to the cat's paw. In this corner, the challenger weighing in at 175 pounds, fresh from the wasteland and new to new Reno, Hurricane. And in this corner, weighing in at 189 pounds, you know him, you love him, Evan Hollyfield. Or Hollyfelds? I don't know. So, without further ado... Let's get ready to beat some butt! Alrighty, we'll go ahead and save. Eh, save over boxing. B. Yes, duh. Done. Now we'll casually approach the child. Ow. Ow. For four. For five. For one. Well, I have no damage. No damage. Okay, I'll be right back. One moment. Oh, I got a lucky crit. Uh, 
And the winner is... By means of knockout... Hurricane! Darn fine performance up there. Doing alright, feeling alright. Um, let me rest a little and I'll be ready. Yeah, okay. So I think the, the next one is the last one. And if that's the case, I need to be at full health. And I need to save Scummit. Like, really bad. Like, really extremely a lot, actually. Um, so let me use my stim packs to get to full health. Yeah, I want, like, full health. Max it out. Okay, done. Save game on Jimbin here. Yes, done. Uh, ready to get back in the ring? I'm ready. Okay. Let's see if I can pull this off. Ladies and gentlemen. Boys and girls. Tonight's match is brought to you by... New Reno Arms! When you need to kill someone from a safe distance, come to New Reno Arms! In this corner, the challenger, weighing in at 175 pounds, fresh from the wasteland and new to New Reno, Hurricane! And in this corner, weighing it at 194 pounds, you know him, you love him, the Masticator! So without further ado, let's get ready to bleed some butt. Okay, Goris is going nude out of excitement. Okay, save over boxing here. And let me give this a few shots. I'll be right back if I can manage to get a crit on him and knock him out. One moment. Woo! I got lucky and actually killed him. Um. And the winner is... By means of knockout, but knocking his spine out of his torso, Hurricane! You eat lightning and crap thunder, kid. Uh... I've defeated the Masquerade, I've gained 3,500 actually. Neat. Cool. Alright. Hey. So I'll go ahead and save over Jimbin then. Done. So now I think that makes me a prize fighter. Yeah, neat. Heavyweight champion of Northern California. Gain fame, respect, love of thousands, and a bonus to your toughness and unarmed skill. Cool. Neato. Um. So hold on, did that give me something? Or did that just... Uh, I don't know. Anyway. I'm done! So I can loot these now, I think. Locked? Well, let me save and make sure I can loot these. Done. Successfully disable the lock. What's in here? Ooh. I and mean, I'll take it. Save the lock. Boxing gloves, eh. Nothing. Come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, that 25 XP leveled me up. Neat. Give me all this. Give me all this. Give me all these. Done. Okay, um, character. I'm at level 23, one more level and I can get Sniper. Uh, I will go up to 100 unarmed. Just as like a roleplay thing. I boxed really good, I go up to 100 unarmed. And the other three... I'll go put into... I don't know. Uh, one in first aid and two in... I don't know. I can't raise these, I don't think. No. I'll just go... Uh, 
Two more in unarmed, why not? Oh, one more in unarmed. Okay. And this last one can be put into Um Um Science Done. Okay, cool. Save over Jimbin again. Yes. Done. Okay. Uh and then I can unlock these ones. Give me what's in this locker. You can't stop me. Took all of your nothing. Took every nothing that was in that locker. Boxing gloves. I don't need boxing gloves. Failed to disable the lock. Successfully disabled the lock. Money. Knuckles and armor and a knife. Bag, they're just done. Take all. But whatever. I got it one by one. Successfully disable the lock. Can't carry that. That's fine. Not really worth the carry weight, honestly. Is that getting it? Well, I guess I didn't need one. Anyway, that's it. Uh, that'll be all for this episode. Thanks a bunch for watching. That's a a good way to deal with stress is by boxing. It's a, a well-encouraged um, thing to do. Anyway, yeah. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye